students to discuss about time table of events during pregnancy in human beings the pregnancy period is about 280 days okay 3 months plus 10 days 280 days it is also called gestation period it is defined as a time period between the conception and the development of the growing baby that is called pregnancy period gest or gestation period time table of events during pregnancy the human pregnancy lasts 9 months 9 months okay gestation can be divided into three trimesters this is the period of the 9 months that is divided into three trimesters three trimesters each one of the trimester that is about three months each okay about three months each one of the trimester that is about three months each and uh, totally that is uh, three trimesters after one month of pregnancy one month of pregnancy after the one month of pregnancy the embryo heart is formed the embryo heart is formed okay sir so during the end of the first trimester organogenesis is completed okay different organs or different parts are developed heart is formed after the one month of pregnancy the embryo heart is formed first sign of growing fetus may be noticed by listening of the heart sounds carefully through the help of the stethoscope okay student next by the end of second month second month fetus develops limbs and the digits digits means fingers okay next by end of the second trimester second trimester it is the second trimester second trimester body is covered with the fine hair and eyelids separate eyelids are separate and eye lashes also forms by the end of the nine months by the end of the nine months of pregnancy fetus is fully developed fetus is fully developed okay and ready to the maturation or the delivery of the baby from the inner part of the uterus okay next and the maturation what are about the maturation student act of giving birth to baby act of giving birth to baby it is also called process of the delivery of fetus maturation means process of delivery of fetus okay student next it is induced by neuro endocrine mechanism it is the maturation delivery of the baby induced by neuro endocrine mechanism okay signal in this firstly signals for maturation signals for delivery of the baby originate from developed fetus placenta developed fetus and placenta signals for maturation originate from the developed fetus fully developed fetus in placenta and um, induce uterine contractions uterine wall goes to the contraction it is induced okay that is the uh, entire action action by the developed fetus placenta which induce uterine wall contractions that is called fetal ejection reflex fetal ejection reflex okay student it is a maturation firstly signalized with the fetal ejection reflex 
ओके दिस इनिशियल फिल्टर एजेक्शन रिफ्लेक्स इनिशियट रिलीज ऑफ ऑक्सीटोसिन फ्रॉम द पिट्यूटरी ग्लैंड ओके दिस इज इनिशियट रिलीज ऑफ द ऑक्सीटोसिन हार्मोन फ्रॉम द पिट्यूटरी ग्लैंड एंटीरियर पार्ट ऑफ द पिट्यूटरी ग्लैंड ओके ऑक्सीटोसिन एक्ट्स ऑन द यूट्रिन मसल this is the hormone this is the hormone releases from the anterior part of the pituitary acts on the muscles of uterus and causes the contractions contractions of the muscles present in the uterus cause of uh, uterine contractions okay sir this leads to this leads to leads to expulsion of the baby out of uterus through the birth canal yes sir excess amount of the oxytocin releases releases by the pituitary gland it is increases the contraction of the uterus muscles and finally it leads to expulsion of the baby out of the uterus through the birth canal Okay, sir. This is about the parturition. Okay, sir. Plus it the decidua, decidua is also comes outside through the birth canal after the delivery of the baby. Next student lactation. What about the lactation? Lactation that means. production the release of the milk after the birth by women is called lactation production release of the milk after birth by women that is called lactation question in response to sucking by new born in response to sucking by new born and milk synthesis is stimulated by prolactin hormone prolactin it is the hormone hormone produces from the anterior part of the pituitary okay it is acts on the mammary gland to synthesize milk from the mammary glands okay milk produced during the initial days initial few days that is the initial few days of the lactation is called colostrum okay this what is the meaning of the colostrum 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 that means milk produces during the initial days of the lactation by the mother okay that is called colostrum colostrum that consists of IgA type of the antibodies. These are the antibodies present in the colostrum. Gives protection from the various type of the infections. Okay, this is the lactation. Is also or breastfeeding. Breastfeeding is also recommended by the doctors. Okay, that uh, is uh, leads to give a healthy baby, healthy growing baby.